Hey Gosford Hill, how you doing? Errol here. Listen, great just to be able to connect with you guys again, especially those of you that I worked with for a few weeks in school. God bless you guys. You know, I'm thinking of you, believing in you. And when I was at school, I shared with you guys three kind of key messages. I want to refresh you, just remind you of those three key points. The first one was this, guys, the value and the importance of choosing the right friends. I told you my story, how I've, my parents are divorced and I went off the rails, got involved with the wrong crowd, got involved with the wrong kind of friends. And I explained to you how your friends determine how high or how far you'll go in life. I talked to you about four kinds of friends, the dividers, the adders, the multipliers, and the takers. Guys, remember, please remember, don't ever forget Errol spoke to you about those four friends. The multipliers are those you want to spend time with the most. Surround yourself with them. Build yourself up with them. Allow them to push you further so you can be the best you can be. If you've got friends around you who are not going where you're going, not doing what you're doing, are holding you back, you've got to be courageous, guys, and let some of those friends go. It's the way it is. It's life. You've got to choose your future over your friends. Number two, I said to you guys, you got to take responsibility. Take 100% responsibility. Forget blaming people. Forget blaming mom or dad or, or sir or miss or my past or whatever you've been involved in. Decide today again. Re remind yourself, guys, time now to take 100% responsibility. You're not blaming no one else for your situation right now, for the results you get in your exam this year. You can make it happen if you choose to put the time in, put the work in, switch off from the distractions and tell yourself, I'm taking 100% percent responsibility if it's meant to be it's up to me i'm gonna make it happen this year and the last thing was, was this guy it was about being courageous yes it's all about stepping out of your comfort zone out of that place of familiarity that place of comfort and taking some risks some steps of faith saying to yourself you know what i'm gonna dare not to conform i'm gonna dare to be different dare to not follow my friends dare to not follow the crowd and say to yourself you know what I'm going to choose some big goals, some big dreams. I'm going to take some chances with my, in this stage in my life. I'm going to be courageous because I'm going to break out. And you can do it. Every single one of you can do it. I believe in you. It's exam season right now. This is it. You've been in school 12 years, preparing for, revising for, working for these exams. Let's not let it go to waste. Shake off all that apathy and, and sense of I can't do or what's the point. Guys, there's a point to this. You get those grades this year, especially your maths, your science, your English. You get those grades this year, you're not having to come back next year and do them again. You're setting yourself up for success. That's what these exams are all about, guys. Setting yourself up for success. I'm kind of pleading with you here. You know what's inside you. You know what you're capable of. You know you can do anything when you set your mind to it. When you make up your mind to do it, you know you can do it. You know you can do it. So I'm challenging you guys today, guys. Arise. Step up. Step to the plate. Make this exam season count. Make this exam season count. I'm rooting for you. I'm believing in you. I'm praying for you. I'm believing for the very best for you in this exam season. I wish you all the best. You know you can hit me up anytime on Instagram or on Twitter. Uh, you can hit me up on email if you need to. You can check out my website, errorlawson.com. I'm here to encourage you and see you be the best that you can be. See you again at the top. <laughs>